on the perimeter road and I'm looking at this property here in front of us. So let's go in and check it out. You have off-road parking there and a pedestrian gate there. It's quite a long road, Cavachos. And it brings you into a lovely garden area. So the garden area itself is all tiered and I'll show you that now. As I just walk around here. As you can see, lovely area, lovely and tiered. Here is the garage or your carport area. Your plug and socket there and switch. Just pan around for you guys. Just in here, you've got a room. So this is a great extra room here. You could turn this into a granny annex, I would imagine. It is just being used as storage. But it would make a great annex here. Well, there you got strip light there as well. I'm quite visual when I see things. So you could have two windows there, you could block that off. All this could be a living space. That could be a bedroom. You could have a small bathroom here and a back door. You could make this an amazing property. I'm walking around and I'm going to enter the house, not by the front, but I will enter it by the kitchen and I'll show you in a minute of why. So there's the front, that's where you'd normally go. You have an underbuilt here, plenty of storage in here, if you can see. Mosaic tiling here, and this is the gated entrance to the pool area. There's the pool. So this is the house itself. Great big pool with steps over there, and you have steps here as well. This is a Neptune style deluxe. We are on sector D. There is a church around the corner. Different denominations use it, I'm told. You have got lights surrounding the pool area and your shower. Just over here, you've got a little kitchen in here. So you've got a nice outdoors kitchen if you want to make anything for the family. Your granite workshops, sink and drainer, gas hob over there, electric microwave and oven. Lovely units, really nice kitchen. And just in here, let's have a look in here. So this is just storage. Oh, you have got a toilet. Just there. Let's go around here and have a look. So you got a pergola area there. And you have another storage shed just here. So you've got the boiler up there, as you can see. And you've got your central heating boiler down there. Okay. So what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to take you in and see the main house. As you can see, loads of mature shrubs and trees and the walls are raised for privacy. So I'll see you at the top of the stairs, guys. So just here we have a nice terrace where you can sit and have some outside dining guys. Just focus out for you a bit. And across there you can see the kids playing in the pool and you've got fantastic views over there as well. So I'm just going in to the kitchen. So let's go inside. 
so just in here guys it's a little bit windy up here you have the upstairs into the top box but I'm going to take you around the main house first so in here is the kitchen it's got high gloss cupboards from top to bottom integrated oven and microwave and you've got a gas hob there just over this side you got your dishwasher and your washing machine more high glass cupboards space and drawers top and bottom also got your fridge freezer there I'm gonna pan around for you guys give you a nice look at that now this is your dining area just here and you've got a radiator just there I'll come over here and give you a better view of the room so you have aircon above there you've got records and blackout blinds on the windows and you've got radiators you have radiators and aircon throughout this house so which is a really good thing so you have another radiator just here And just out here is the D section. So this is where it used to be the terrace. It's been enclosed to make extra accommodation for you guys. So nice and big as well. And a radiator out here. You've also got ceiling lights and fans above there. Okay. Just there you have a feature fireplace. It's never been used by the looks of it. You could put a log burner fire in there. You have aircon and central heating radiators in this room as well. So I'm just going to go through the archway. Before I do, I'll just pan around slowly for you guys so you can see the room. Okay. So just in here, you've got your main master bedroom. You've got aircon again, central heating, blackout blinds and records on the window, ceiling lights and fans, TV points, switches and sockets on either side of the bed, and you've got your archway which leads down to the ensuite. You've also got two wardrobes. You've got a double wardrobe with overhead storage, and you've got a single one here by the bathroom which is good for keeping your towels and your bits and bobs got a frosted glass window in there your bath shower attachment you've got a wc you've got a bidet and your sinking pedestal all done on with gray tiling and above a nice um cream there's your shower attachment just there if I pan around this way, slowly, you can see you have an eating one. Ever so sorry. So let's go through to the next room. Just into the next second bathroom down here. You've got a shower there. You've also got a nice mirror cabinet, vanity unit and sink and WC. You've also got a central heated towel rail there as well. All been retiled, really nice, upgraded shower room. Just go in here for a minute and just show you. Okay, it's all been retiled. So just in here, you have your second bedroom. It has ceiling light and fan, overhead storage and double wardrobes, twin wardrobes, his and hers. You got TV points there, you've got aircon, Blackout blinds and wreckers on the windows, 
two single beds in here you could put a double bed in here no problem at all okay and of course just behind the door there you got your central heating radiator so just going back through and I'm going to take you upstairs to the top box it's quite a large property this so the staircase has been enclosed here so outside the kitchen you have that lovely terrace with beautiful views of the mountainside the mountainside the countryside and just above here we're going up top of the steps you have a nice decorative ornate handrail so I've come to the top of the top box and what's unusual about this one is that it has two rooms not just one so we go into the first room here the large double bedroom double wardrobes air con again you got your central heating radiator up here TV points really nice vanity unit in there and you have your bidet and your toilet so you have had an upgraded shower here they had a bath in here and i think they've taken it out and they've upgraded the shower okay and as a clear screen shower screen and of course the unit there matches the shower and the tiles just out here you have the nice outside garden area this is your rooftop solarium nice place to sit and some fantastic views all around So let me take you into the other room. I'll go back in through here. So this is quite a large double bedroom as well. So you're spoiled for choice if you've got family or friends over, you know. So just in here, they've used this as an office. But you could easy, it's big enough for a double, it's a double bedroom really, you know. you got your radiator just there, your aircon above the door, and it's total separate unit. You've got insect screens on the windows, beautiful views, nice big office if you wanted to work from home. So let me take you back down the stairs now guys. So guys what do you think of this one? This is a fantastic house. It's really large. Aircon and central heating throughout. It has great potential. It is a four bedrooms. Two bedrooms on the top box. Two downstairs. And three bathrooms en suites. There is a toilet downstairs and a small outside kitchen. And, of course, around the garage way, that it could make a potential granny annex. Very easy, you know, because the structure's already there and you have that extra room, which could be a bedroom, you know. Do a little bathroom of that living space and um, it's all basically done for you, you know. You've got some tremendous views. I was going to sit out on the terrace up there with the views in the background, but it's a bit windy. So, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you do get in touch with info at selectselltoby.com. Check out our website. Don't forget to share and like on your social media. Thanks for watching, guys, and i see you again soon. Don't forget to share and like. Take care.